this litigation. What we see in the copyright area is the pendulum has swung very, very far in the direction of copyright holders. You know, I, I, we share Jonathan's every interest in going after pirates and going after bad guys and going after criminals. But you've got to do it in such a way as you're not bringing legitimate actors, consumers, my members, into the net. And, you know, again, that, that's why we are advocating to reopen the DMCA to reach that balance. Okay, quickly, David. Balance is terrific, and we th I think Congress reached that proper balance in 1998. Uh, having the Copyright Office try and review, having the standard be primary purpose or, or no other uh, legitimate use uh, really, reaches that, re really reaches that balance. The fact that a couple of people have brought lawsuits that Michael may not uh, agree with, um, I mean, there's lawsuits brought under 18 U.S.C. 1030, the Computer Fraud and Abuse Act. You know, there are people who bring lawsuits against McDonald's. Um, there's all sorts of laws. That doesn't mean we repeal the underlying law because people bring uh, lawsuits under it that some people might not agree with. I think that the courts are, are going to find their way with this. I think that the law is working terrifically, and now is not the time uh, to pull the plug on the DMCA, which is what H.R. 107 would do. Okay. Fred. I'll just say thanks for your time and enjoy the rest of a lovely day. <laughs> Thank you, everybody. Thank you to the panelists.